everybody, Stu Carter here from Atomic.com. I'm at Times Square in New York City for the annual toy fair. While we're here, let's have a look at some of those special toy stores you can only find in New York City. So come on, let's have a tour. Well, here I'm outside FAO Schwartz now. now if you're visiting New York and you like toys, you've got to you got to visit this place. Uh, there's some mass market toys in here, but of the most interest are some of the displays, uh, life-size Lego toys. They've got a Barbie foosball table. Of course, the big piano from the uh, movie Big. Uh, and uh, they have some specialty plush toys, which may be of some interest to collectors. The Fayo Swartz have been here more than 100 years in New York City. And did you know that Lego has a store? Apparently, they've got at least one here in New York City, not far from F.A.L. Swartz, at a place called Rockefeller Center. There's a Lego store. Let's go inside and have a look. So inside the Lego store, they have a huge display of the Lego bricks, uh, I guess representing all the colors that you can get. I don't know if you can buy these individually, perhaps so, but there's a, a, a lot here on display. And they are offering a let you build your own minifigure. Uh, they've got the parts down here for this guy, see? And then you put them together and you can put them in his own little display case here. Lego Star Wars Imperial Shuttle. $300 for this set, apparently. And it looks like it's motorized, I would hope so, for, for $300 and it comes with one figure, one Star Wars trooper. Here's the Tower Bridge. It's a Tower of London in, in the UK. And this set, if you wanted to buy one, it would be $265. Diagon Alley play set from Harry Potter, $165. But it has a lot of the figures inside the set. Now it's a nice display at the Lego store. Those houses look very nice. Little shops. Obi-Wan's Jedi Starfighter, $110. Ninja Go, of course, we've seen a worldwide simultaneous release for this toy. These toys, we've seen them in Hong Kong, we've seen them in Japan, and now we see them in the US. There's the spinning fighters in the back. Lego Hero Factory. A nice display here. the Star Wars at, -AT Walker big play set. I don't see a price for this guy. Is that Luke or is that another uh, Starfighter guy going up and you can see inside the control cockpit of the at, -AT Walker and then they've got the Hoth Wampa Cave play set on display here and that looks pretty scary. Is that Luke hanging upside down? Look out Luke! Here's a fireboat play set, $55. Looks nice. He's fighting the fire from the bow of the ship. And here's a Republic Swamp Speeder for $33. Oh, I see Darth Vader in the back with some stormtroopers and some droids. Republic Swamp Speeder. I never knew Darth Vader went into the swamps. And from Harry Potter, here's Hogwarts Castle. Lots of figures in this set as well. I guess it expands out and you can see inside all the castle. Oh, that's where they're having their Thanksgiving dinner, I guess. <laughs> and that's where he's doing some sorcery. Oh, and there's some gargoyles or something on the top. I don't know what they are. They look scary. And here, here is a big Lego representation, a build of 
Rockefeller Plaza. That's supposed to be the ice rink in the bottom down there. And then we see the familiar sculpture and the 30 Rock, the studios, the NBC studios. All made out of Legos. And here's all the people. Lots of Lego people. And they're all working or they're having their lunch. There's a fire truck. Oh, and what's Darth Vader doing on top of the building here? That's Rockefeller Plaza. Darth Vader doesn't belong there. What's he doing? And Pharaoh's Quest is a new property for Lego, and this is the Scorpion Pyramid. I guess that's the Scorpion. He looks pretty dangerous. And I don't see a price on that, but it looks pretty elaborate. And there's some bad guy looking guy on the front of the pyramid. That's kind of scary. And this is all new this year from Lego. Pharaoh's Quest. Well, this place looks kind of familiar. I don't know whether I've seen this before, but I've seen it someplace. It's near the Lego store. That's a pretty sculpture anyway.